day two with the Fuji X-T4 and I've been loving it. Absolutely, I couldn't stop talking about it to my wife last night and I probably talked her ear off and I actually couldn't even sleep last night. I was just thinking of all the images I wanted to take with the X-T4. Now don't get me wrong, I still love Sony and I think the Sony is, the Sony system, the, the cameras, they are perfect for like getting the job done. They are absolutely amazing work machines. But this camera is just inspiring, the way it looks, the way it feels. And I'm not even talking about these dials, because I don't think I'm going to be turning these dials at all. I have it set so like I have shutter and um, uh, shutter and ISO on these wheels here, where it controls a little bit more like a Sony camera. I'm not going to be fiddling with these knobs on top. I don't like doing that. But um, got the 16-1-4 on here. Amazing size camera. It's actually kind of the same size as an A7 III with like a 55 on it too. So it's not exactly the smallest camera, but I think with smaller lenses, like this is actually a pretty beefy lens for a Fuji camera. But I couldn't sleep last night, like I was saying. I was just so excited and I haven't felt this way in a long time. Like I'm just realizing the possibilities that I can do. I can finally like go out with just one camera again, shoot the way I want to shoot, shoot close. That's one thing that full frame cameras really kind of lack. It's the ability to just shoot really really close like I want to shoot close and this can do that which I you know after moving to full frame and having all these pro cameras a lot of those cameras their minimum focus distance is not very close so this is the one that can do it plus I know I'm a vain guy I love shooting selfies look at I can shoot selfies with this flip screen that's amazing I can shoot video just talking into it there's ibis very cool. This is so awesome. I am absolutely loving this. And check this out. I got this in the mail today. Amazon Prime. Let's get some scissors. I got this thing called a soft shutter release. And have you ever seen like Fuji users with like that red button on the top? Like, oh man, that red button looks so cool. It's so swaggy. That's what I got. It was like 15 bucks. But it's gonna make this camera, I think, look like a million bucks. It comes with two of them. Like I said, on Amazon, look up soft shutter release. They look like little pills. These little pills. Is that focusing or not? I feel like it's not. Oh well. Let's see. Alright, comes with a little card. There we go. Little card saying thank you for buying these little things. Let's put these on. So there's like a little, I don't know, you probably can't see this, but there's like a little washer there. I think it just screws into the top because you can just screw it in this way. And, and there it is. I mean, as simple as that. Look at that. There's a red button on my Fuji. Oh my gosh. Let's just let's just try this soft shutter. Let's try this sh soft shutter. Oops, just turned it off. Wrong dial. Still getting used to things. Here we go. Oh, it feels good. I love this. Wow, this is so cool. I think if you're a Fuji owner, you gotta get one of these. It just looks amazing. And it actually matches the, you know, the peak design. It's like a red and black aesthetic. So sweet. Oh, I'm falling in love. Of course, I wouldn't want to use this to shoot events or professionally. I don't think that's what this is for, but for every single thing else, I think this is gonna be so much fun to use. I was wondering, am I going to regret going back to Fuji? So far, not a single one. Except I didn't get a whole lot of sleep last night because I was just so excited about getting this camera and using it. I'm going to be going out today. I have a shoot today. I'll be using the Sonys and um, 
doing some video, doing some high-end photography. I'm gonna take this out too and just kick around with it and see what I can get. Share some of those images with you soon. And um, that's it for today. This was exciting enough. Little red button. How amazing is that? All right, guys. Well, hopefully you guys have a good one. If you're excited about Fuji as well, let me know. If you're a Fuji user, tell me what you love about your Fuji camera because I'm finding that I love the X-T4. But I am not going to deny that I do not like the X-T3 at all. So, still an X-T3 hater, I'm sorry. But the X-T4, so good.